Why start an online business? Why should you start an online business as opposed to a conventional brick and mortar business? There are a few good reasons for doing this. It costs a lot less to start an online business. You do not need to hire any staff. You do not need an office or other commercial premises. You can start an online business today. You just need a computer or mobile device and a connection to the internet. Work from anywhere. Set your own hours. People are used to making purchases online these days. You do not need any technical skills. You can outsource different tasks to freelancers. If you wanted to open a shop in a mall, then you would need a lot of money to do this. You have to provide stock for your shop and pay commercial rent. Someone has to take care of the shop, and if this is not going to be you, then you will have to hire people. You will also need to advertise your shop. If you are in a busy mall, then you will get some potential customers walk in out of curiosity. But to do really well, you need to do a lot of marketing to get people to your shop. Of course, you will need to advertise your online business as well, and we will cover this in a later section in this training. But it is easier to market an online business than it is a brick-and-mortar business, and your reach is much larger. You can literally sell your products and services to the world with an online business. Work your online business part-time. You can start your online business from home. There are many owners of six-figure online businesses that work from home. They do not need an office, and they are able to work the hours that they choose. If you have a job that pays the bills at the moment, then we recommend that you keep this and develop your online business in your spare time. This can be tough if you have a family, but talk to them and explain that things will be better in the near future. You need your family on board with what you are doing. It is not easy working a full-time job and then switching on your computer to start working on your online business. You need a great deal of commitment and motivation to do this, and in a later section, we will discuss setting goals for your online business and ways that you can drive yourself to take action. Unfortunately, a lot of people that start online businesses fail. There are no published statistics on the reasons for this, but one of the main ones is very likely to be that they did not take their online business seriously. Because there is a low barrier to entry from a financial point of view, many people will give up if they do not get the results that they are looking for. They put in the time and effort initially to get everything set up and then lose interest quickly after that. We do not want this to happen to you. There are no push-button miracles. There's a great deal of hype around making money online and running an online business. New products launch all of the time, claiming that they will show you how to make a fortune overnight with just a few clicks of your mouse. This is totally untrue. It takes time and effort to create a six-figure online business. Some of these products rely on loopholes that are eventually closed, which means that your income will cease. You want to build a sustainable online business. Don't be fooled by the hype. You cannot generate buyer traffic to your offers in less than a minute. This is ridiculous. There is no software out there that is going to magically turn your computer as an ATM. It is amazing that these product vendors get away with these wild claims. A few years ago, there were a number of scams on the Internet where people lost a lot of money and received nothing or next to nothing in return. Over the years, these have disappeared, but you can never be too careful. If you are thinking of buying a product or service to help you with your online business, then check it out thoroughly first. Get started with a domain name and hosting. If you are serious about your online business, which you need to be, then you need your own domain name. There are free services out there that you can use to create a website such as blogger.com, wordpress.com, and weebly.com. Unless you are really strapped for cash, we advise you not to use these services. The reason for this is that people are a lot more internet savvy than they used to be. They know that Blogger is a free website service, and if you launch your business on a free platform like this, then you are going to look cheap. You have to sell things to create a six-figure online business. Trying to sell products and services from a free website is not going to work well. It is very important that you invest in a domain name and some web hosting. You can get a .com domain name from Namecheap.com for less than $10 a year. There are many web hosting companies out there, and you need a web host to make your website live on the Internet. You can get web hosting starting from $5 a month. It is important that the web host you choose offers you a number of different features that we will explain in the section about setting up your website. For now, we just want you to accept that having your own domain name is the best way to go. If you were setting up a conventional business, it would cost you thousands. For an online business, you can start with a $10 a year domain name and $5 to $15 a month web hosting. Make the right impression from the start. In the next video, we will discuss the different online business models that you can choose from.